welcome to Embracing Matches. Thank you to everyone that's liked, shared, subscribed. If you guys have purchased a reading or donated to my page, I appreciate you. Uh, this is going to be your weekly love reading. This energy could be masculine or feminine. could be about you, the person you're thinking of, or your cross watcher. Cross watchers, if you do not have Virgo in your chart or no one around you that does, just know that Spirit brought you here for a message, okay? You want to take what resonates and uh, leave what does not. Virgo. Virgo. Okay, we have peace and transformation. So you guys are trying to keep the peace, trying to find some peace while you go through some sort of transformation. Okay, some guys, some of you. Just want to be at peace. May have a lot of chaos or things going on around you as well. Okay. The transformation is not easy that you're going through for some of you. Some of you will come to a peaceful agreement with someone. Order will be dis, you know, restored to a, to a home situation. You may be arguing with someone. Some of you just need to have some peace, meaning you need to have some me time. You need to pray, you need to meditate, have spiritual baths, stuff of that nature. Go off, have time for yourself, just quiet time to reflect on your life. Some of you need to breathe deeply. Just relax and take care of yourself. Practice self-love right now while you're going through this transformation. Okay, some of you are going through a deep transformation too. It's a lot of things that are happening and changing, but your prayers are being answered, right? You guys may have been praying about some things to change in your life. You may be going through some sort of spiritual awakening that'll change your perception on some things. You guys have to stay positive. Some sort of energetic shift is going on in your life right now. Some of you may have some obstacles. Like I said, you may be going through some things and this is causing you to need peace. Maybe a peace of mind as well. You're having to balance dark and light energy right now. You may be going back and forth with your moods and maybe having some mood swings as well as you're going through this transformation. If you guys want to take it how it resonates with you and your situation. We have oath. We have belonging. And we have listening. Wow. Okay. So I don't have these memorized, but let me get the book. Let me see what this book says here. For oath. So number 49 which breaks down to 13, which breaks down to four, which is structure, stability, and manifestation. 49. Let me see here. So an oath is never made lightly nor in jest. Promises are meant to be honored. When you choose this symbol, perhaps it's time you look at how you have made your promises. Have you crossed your fingers behind your back, relinquishing the magic that binds you to your oath? Has anyone broken his or her promise to you? Let the person go. Don't hold on to someone. Excuse me. Don't hold on if someone refuses to be honorable. You don't want this person in your life. For now, the most important promise you can make is to yourself. 
Promise to be kind, loving, honorable, and good. Do no harm. Okay? So, Spirit is saying right now, someone is not being honorable to you, and you two need to let them go. You have the belonging card. This may be the transformation that you're going through. You may know this also, and this is why, you know, your mind may be busy and you need peace. With belonging, this is number 41, which breaks down to a five, which is change, instability, and conflict. Let's see what this is. You are chosen to belong. This symbol, also, this symbol tells you that you are in the right place right now. You are home. Be at home inside yourself. Learn to be comfortable in your own skin. Okay? Wow. So you guys may not like the way you look right now. You may have issues with how, you know, whatever's going on with your body. Um, you may not see yourself as beautiful or handsome as everyone else does right now. Spirit is telling you to listen, right? On this card, it says listening. Darkness does not always equate to evil and light does not always bring good, okay? I'm not sure what, who that is for, but this is a 23, which breaks down to a five. So you have two fives. So you guys look up angel five, five, okay? Angel five, five, uh, and Google and see what the message is for you. Number 23. Okay, so it's saying reading between the lines and finding true meaning are what are required right now. Listen and learn. What others don't say is what is important at the moment. So you need to pay attention to what's going on around you. People may be saying stuff, but the but you need to, to hone into what they're not saying to you. You need to read between the lines. Okay, because someone may be manipulating you in some way. And not give you, you know, what you need from them or the information. This is the person that Spirit is telling you that you need to walk away from because they're not honorable anyway. Okay? Yeah. You guys are in some sort of tragic romance that you guys are holding on to. What else for Virgo? All right? Some sort of test is coming from the universe. Some offer is going to be a temptation. Okay. The spirit wants you to walk away from whatever person this is. Right. And know that once you walk away, you're going to have uh, blessings. Okay. And your prayers are going to be answered with the spirit of the angel. Okay. Everything is going to be okay if you can get away from this person. Spirit, who is this person? Give me, who, who is this? Give it to me plain so Virgo knows exactly who we're talking about here. Virgo. Virgo. Okay. Okay, it's so a person that you're in separation with or may be thinking about separating from. And this person may be trying to manifest to keep you in their life. Okay. Somebody here is doing some magic situations here. I see unhex. Right. Someone's putting some spell work on someone. Right. Some sort of trust is broken here. And someone needs to apologize to someone else. Someone's going through an emotional roller coaster right now with the tsunami cart. Wow. What else, Spirit? Yep, this is a karmic person. Right? They're, they're meant to, to give you life lessons. You, you're supposed to learn from the situation. Right? Someone's trying to ruin your image. Someone may be telling lies or telling people or talking about you behind your back as well. Right? Someone's being really, really shady. Anything else for Virgo? 
right someone yeah someone's going crazy right here and they may have you going crazy mentally virgo because of the things that they keep putting you through right the spirit says you walk away from this person and you have blessings your card just fell on the floor <laughs> me shuffling you'll have blessings okay wow What else does Virgo need to know? Nothing flipped. What else does Virgo need to know? What else does Virgo need to know, Spirit? What else does Virgo need to know? Thank you. As above, so below. Right? Maybe dealing with someone that doesn't show you their emotions to someone, okay, that doesn't like to. For you to know how they're feeling, they may move a certain way, maybe a Libra or a Scorpio, right? This person likes to avoid conflict, so they may go behind your back and do things, you know, a certain way. If this is you, okay, moving a certain way, you're the one that's avoiding conflict. Okay, you may not be putting your heart on your sleeve, you may not be showing someone how you feel, but you're going to have justice, okay? The scales are going to be balanced in whatever it is that you're going through. Someone's going to get their karma for it. You know, if you guys got to go to court or there's going to be some sort of um, action against you, it's going to be in your favor. If you have some something going on legally, that's going to fall into your favor as well. Okay? Yeah. And this one is a weird one. But Spirit is telling telling you to go forward for your blessings, okay? Sending you love and light. If anyone needs a personal reading, the information is in the box below. Thank you.